everyone so in today's video i'm going to show you how to edit vertical igtv videos in imovie on iphone this is always a big thing since imovie in general can't edit 9 by 16 videos and that is the aspect ratio for a vertical video but unfortunately imovie does not have this feature but there is a way to do this there's almost always a way to do something if the feature is not available you just need to think outside the box so in this video i'm going to be using iMovie as you can see, Fonto and Photos. So iMovie is for video editing, Fonto is for adding text and you'll see what Photos is all about later in this video. So first we're going to go into iMovie, then we're going to click on this plus sign to create a movie. So click on create movie, go to videos, recently added and there you can see all your videos. So now you just select the clips you want to use in your video. So I'm going to use this one and this one. So then on the bottom you can see create movies. So let's create. Here is your clips. As you can see my image is cropped because it is a vertical video. You can see with these black bars on the sides. So we're going to fix that. So press on your timeline down here. And on the top you will see this magnifying glass so if you press on that you pinch to zoom on your image just like that and you can see it's all zoomed out make sure to do it with all your other clips that you have in your video so pinch to zoom again so now what we're going to do is we're going to rotate our video so if you don't know how to do that, I just did a video on that. I'll put that link in the eye on top, but I'll insert a clip as well. So what you do is you take your two fingers and you rotate it to where you want your video to be. So it's just like that. And then we press on the magnifying glass again, pinch to zoom to make sure it is not zoomed in. So let's rotate our other clip as well. Press on the timeline. And then you can rotate your video okay so now that that is done i know this is weird and difficult to edit like this but this is the only way since imovie doesn't have any other way of doing this so now you can edit your video split cut whatever you want to do with it and then we're going to add our text so let's just split over here delete that part let's split here so now that we're done editing, the only problem I know a lot of people will struggle with is adding text. Because if you add text in iMovie, let's press on the timeline. And here you can see to add text. So if you press any of these, let's just say this one, you can see it is horizontally and not vertically. And we want it to be vertically for the editing. And there is no feature in iMovie to rotate it. So what we're going to do, and this is what we're using Fonto for. So let's go down here, add a plain image to this white plain image, go up here to change the size of the image and let's just choose this one for now and if you press on the color you change the alpha to zero so that it will be transparent. I prefer transparent over green screen because you can't move your text if you have green screens so you have to crop it and all that kind of stuff but with transparent background it's much easier then you see on the top apply let's click on the share and say use so here you have your transparent canvas so what we do now is you press on it and say add text so here we're gonna say coffee time and here you can change the font but it is already on the font that i want to use so let's go out and say done so here is my text and i want it to be black so i press on style and choose black say done on the top so you can resize it and we're gonna tilt ours to be 90 degrees so it just makes everything easier for editing so unfortunately there is not another way I can think of to do this because in iMovie as I said if you add text it is going to be horizontally and not vertically. So then you press on the share button on the bottom and say save as PNG. So now it is saved to your library. So now we go to iMovie again and we're going to press this 
plus button add a photo so let's go to photos go to favorites and here is my photo so if I press on that and press on the three dots you can say picture in picture so here you can see it's added so if you press on this image so on the top you can see here's three buttons so if you press on the middle one you can resize it and move it to where you want it to be so I think it's right here it's just difficult that you can't see where you are adding or how big it is there okay so we're just gonna put that there and you can also change the duration of your image okay so now you can add text to wherever you want it to be so once you're done editing your video and adding text click down on the top and click on the share button in the middle and say save video so now it's exporting your video so your movie is done exporting and it says the movie was exported to your photo library so let's say ok so now let's go to photos so now that we're in photos you're gonna see what we use photos for so if you go to your video that you just created and on the top you will see edit so if you press on edit then go down to where you see your crop and rotate icon so if you press on that you rotate your video to the right orientation so now you have successfully edited and rotated your video so in photos down here there is a filter icon so if you press on that here's also filters that you can choose from and use in your video I know iMovie doesn't have that many options for filters so here you have options as well so now you can upload your video on IGTV or your statuses or you can just use it for your own personal use so let's say done and then we are done now it's just on the bottom preparing video and making all the changes so now your video is done preparing and you are ready to use it thanks so much for watching this video I hope it was helpful and that you could have learned something from it Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and remember to click the bell notification to get any notifications when we upload a video. And please give this video a big thumbs up and feel free to leave a comment down below. Hope you guys have a lucky day. Bye!